Hello everyone, welcome to Bargain Gaming, where we can play excellent games without busting our wallets. This is episode 36 of the Battle of Guandu scenario within the Romance of the Three Kingdoms number 14 game. So right now we have, in this turn, we have been, last turn, previous episode, uh, we were, uh, no, no, uh, the two, two episodes ago we were poaching the prisoners under that were Chow Chow we were poaching Chow Chow's officers that were prisoners that we captured when we took over Chen Liu and then in the last episode it was like bonanza time when the Yuan Tan and Yuan Xiang they split apart and so I know Yuan Xiao died so the general loyalty of the officers deteriorate deteriorate deteriorated sorry I can't talk my tongue is so thick. When general loyalty of all the officers deteriorated, deteriorated very drastically. So we have sent officers out to poach them, and so I'm looking forward to seeing how many officers we actually get. So this is the next turn. So from Chao Chao has arrived. Ooh, Bianchi. Yes. Sun Yu, whom you've taken prisoner, your leniency is appreciated. Uh, Sun Yu. Ooh, 20,000 gold. We will take it. We will take it. Yes, thank you very much. Twenty thousand gold. Teaching us with Sun Guan. Yes, that's a, one of the prisoners we have. Cao Cao's officers. Lu Xiang, Qian Zhou. Oh, this guy is Yuan Xiao in Puyang. Yes, sir. Chen Lin. Yes, sir. Yuan Xiao again. Yes. Zhang Yan. Oh, this is a good catch. Okay, these are some I've never looked at this. Uh, so what happened? Li Ximin's allies have arrived in Runan. Arrived in Su Chang. Okay. Uh, and a foreign policy, there are no action. Plots, military, history. Uh Jing Ye purchased fifty one thousand worth of supplies for Chen Liu. Oh this okay, so this is what we did. Okay. Ah, oh, okay. Middle of the month. Okay. Uh, where are we in terms of forces? 97... 9.7. 9 oh, we're still... Ooh. Yeah, we need... I don't think that is 0.3 right here. This is less than 0.3. But if we take this, I think we might have the 0.3 that will kick us up to the next rank. Uh, I think we need to take... Oh, I... Yeah, we have not removed this camp yet. Okay, uh, let us check. Hold on, before we proceed, uh, let. Good idea to save this. And uh, I think two episodes ago we were looking at our doctrine and because we control the kind of background our created officers will have in terms of doctrine and we are pretty advanced in doctrine and that's why when we look at our city we can see that the durability of our city this is a medium-sized city it has 
uh, 4,000 durability. That's part of the doctrines in terms of support. And then morale is 130. That is also, I think, part of support. Uh, what is not evident from here is uh, the kind of ships we can use. And also, I think if we say, say, say we do a march. Uh, Jingye is, okay, uh, Li Gui is not occupied, currently occupied. We can actually get him out there. Zhang Ba is not occupied. Oh, before we do that, I think we just um, recruited a bunch of officers from both Cao Cao and Yuan Xiao. So I think it's a good idea to actually uh, boost their loyalty with us. <laughs> okay, uh, and then are there any more people? Okay, going back to... Yeah, because on the appointments, on the Doctrine side... See, we have... Support is, so, is very solid, and so is this. This is what we're seeing in terms of... Uh, cities higher durability is 4,000. Morale of units is at 130. Uh, what else? Uh, supply consumption. We cannot. We don't see this, but this is part of it. We're uh, maneuver and transport loads of transport units are increased. Uh, so we can now build. I think we can build catapult towers. Are we at ten? Yeah, we can build catapult towers. In the previous game, we we couldn't build catapult towers. Well, we can... Let's check if we can do this here. Um, say if we march out... Li Gui. Right? <coughs> <coughs> Sorry about that. Sorry. And let's say we use the, the arrow. And we can march out 8,000. Okay, and then we can come, let him come over here. Say, build something. Uh, build. Attack. Allow. Uh, yeah, we can now build catapult towers. So, right now, because we have a better understanding of the gameplay mechanics, so right now, even at level, in the past when we were already at like king rank, we're currently only at the regional, regional governor. So the third rank, first lieutenant, then regular governor. I think I think we're just regular governor. So, so you know, just even the second rank, we can now build catapult towers. It's because of the support that we have given. Uh, I mean the doctrine we have adopted, and so we have hit level 10 already in that doctrine so we can build all of this i think this one is specific to a general's ability this is not some this is this is this is not part of doctrine this is part this is only part yeah so fire ship and fire trap these are specific to officer uh, abilities not uh, general doctrine General Doctrine allows us to build these, these already. So, uh, we can do catapult towers and they... So, they, they have a longer dust range because... Yeah, this is uh, Arrow Tower, which we have seen a lot in the first uh, app, in the first playthrough. Uh, there's one to two range. This one is two to three. So, this is fantastic. But before we destroy, uh, build that, I want to destroy this first. And then wait. Because after that, once we've built the, uh, uh, the catapult towers, I want to move the catapult towers closer to here. 
so that if they come out to attack us, they will bump into the assault, uh, the catapult towers. Uh, and it has a range of two to three, so we can build it within our territory. Uh, but yeah, he has to destroy that one first. Okay, uh, so that's one thing about doctrine. So uh, that's something I, I finally figured out. That's what it means, or that's what it's supposed to mean. Okay. Uh, other thing is, uh, do we want to build more, to buy more food stuff? Yeah, because we, we just got paid 20,000 gold from Cao Cao. Uh, we can buy another uh, 70,000 uh, food stuff here and ship uh, 72. In the past, the shipping maximum we get is only 62,000. So right now we can actually ship seventy-two thousand, so a little bit, you know, ten thousand more. Uh, it's not uh, hugely, uh, what do you call this? Uh, it's not, it's not, yeah, it's significantly huge. But uh, yeah, that is. Those are the overt effects of our more advanced doctrines. And then also our marching ability is much faster. So let's say we're, we're, we're transporting uh, to... We can use Eugene Goyan. Uh, oh, nobody. Oh, this one. Oh, Deng Zhao has a transporter. But uh, he is not as useful as a transporter. Let's say if you look at, at Deng Zhao, let's just try him out. And just to see the comparison uh, 1000 and so 72 in the past it was just always 62 is is the maximum that we were able to send out so if we're sending them out to Sinye it will take 26 days if the officer has the transporter ability so let's check if it's somebody else uh, let's say instead of Deng Zhao we said wait how many days was it I can't 24 days right no, 26. Okay, 26. Okay, back. If it's a Deng without uh, an officer without that ability, let's say we use Goyan. Same, everything's the same. It will take them 41 days. So that's the importance of the transporter ability. The other thing is that I think because of our. Uh, we have level 10 in our support. Uh, support doctrine uh, if not this would be much longer uh, instead of 41 days it will be much longer I don't know I'm guessing in the 50 50 plus days or something add another 20% maybe yeah, 49 50 50 days uh, so I guess it's a good it would be good to use Deng Zhao because it only took takes uh, 26 days Plus the fact is that we're currently not using him. We will be. It's like what a wait a waste, right? Because he has 85 intelligence and 82 politics. So, uh, so there are very few people who are actual transporters. So I wish there are more people that we can uh, that there are more people in the game that can do transport, especially in this particular this this particular game because of the game mechanics where we need to move food around a lot okay so right now we have only found two guys uh, that's uh, Gong, Gong Du and uh, Deng Zhao so let's click yes uh, let's move the food down here wow 26 days is against 41 days that's almost half the uh, travel time of any other generals uh, so that means we now have uh, leeway in our inventory so we can buy maybe 15,000 bucks worth a hundred thousand more or a little bit more a hundred thousand more food or even a little bit more is okay uh, let's just not use Jiancheng or Huarong because uh, they are in the one. Oh, we can use them because uh, it's not. Because by the next 
by the next turn. Wow, that's 113. Uh, 260 in four months, we will be maxed out again. No, that's yeah, that is maybe too much. Let's just buy a hundred. No, 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 I really didn't even click on a uh, hundred. Fourteen thousand. Yeah, that sounds. That's pretty good, right? Yeah, and we have twenty-five thousand left, so we have. We're comfortable that we have uh, quite a few gold. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, we're producing a lot of food and a lot of gold, so. Um, I think this is okay. We are sixty-five thousand. People now. Okay. Uh, and are there people we can still employ? Cheng Yu, oh, these are all at 100%. Gojia. Why did they not? Why didn't he go for Gojia? Gojia is. Maybe he's just comfortable. He will never lose his. Uh, Loyalty, I mean. Bei Ping. Su Yu Jin Yang. Da Yuan. Jin Yang, Bei Ping, Yan Rao. Can we get her now? So apparently she is not hireable. Means, yeah, there's no way we can hire her. Jin Yang, the governor. I don't think we can hire her. Right, yeah. Yeah, I don't think we can hire her. Despite their... Uh, yeah, despite their low... Yeah, despite their low... Uh, loyalty, apparently these are like... Hardliners for the Yuan family. Uzi is. Yeah, he's a kind of mediocre guy. Why not? Why not? <laughs> Gao Lan, yeah, we have people out there. Jiao Chu. Ah, Nan Bi. Men is in Beiping. Wow, they're so far away. How about this guy? Yeah, I guess we have uh, poachables. Are I think? How about yeah, yeah. Uh, These guys are so far away, it's just... I don't know if that's worth... Uh, whoa, 40 days... No, Jin Kun, not Jin Kun. Lin Chong? Okay, we are not really getting very good talent. Uh, yeah, they're just mediocre people. Uh, how 
How about search? We have not done any searches this turn. Okay. Xiao Chun. Zoba. Lu Jiang. Chen Liu. Why? Why from so far away? Uh... Yeah. We don't want any trainers. <coughs> you know what? I forgot. Uh, since when we sent Shisu back here, I think uh, in the area. <coughs> Sorry. Sorry about that. <coughs> mm. This guy is not, it's pretty low level. I think we'll change him with Shisu is yes. And let's go back to search. Not Shimin. We don't want you. Uh, we don't want you interrupting your. Chupa. Xiao Chun. I'm Chupa. Then let's go. No, let's go back to Xiao Chun then. <laughs> we don't want to, uh, we don't want to dis distract our trainers that much. No, forget it. Okay. Okay, let's move to the next, uh, <laughs> And let's see how many people, because some of them will take 20, under 30 days to uh, Trian, so apparently, yeah, it's not. Oh, yeah. what a waste. That was a, that was a head fake. Yep, we've been head faked twice. Three times. Okay. Yes, okay. Yan Chao's guys again. Yes, this is good guy. This is a great guy to get. Thank you, thank you. Yes. This is a so so guy. Okay, uh, now is the end. So, part of our part of our administration is that in the battle stuff we are at ten ten, right? Uh, strength of arrows. This is this is actually ten plus because uh, this one and big boss. Are related strengthen armed forces, strengthen armed forces. Compared to this one up here, that big boss has that strengthen armed forces. So we are ten. So this is actually we're at twelve. Uh, we but it doesn't. This game doesn't allow us to go over twelve. So here, strengthen armed forces includes a lot of other stuff, which includes like effectiveness of arrow, effectiveness of fish. Uh, Crane, 
owl. So all the different formations, tower, ring, all the formations are accounted for under this. All, uh, all, all in capturing. I mean, the all is like a whole net, right? Strength and armed forces. It captures everything. Uh, and because we have, we are at ten at that level. We, if we look at Li Kui, we can see that the unit information, we are, so our, he's marching in arrow formation. His arrow formation is like 488 on defense and 1200 in terms of assault. And this is, I think we achieved this uh, in our previous uh, playthrough only uh, towards the latter part of the game. Uh, because we didn't have 10 at that point in time and so we have huge huge advantages in terms of uh, the capability of our troops uh, given that we have already hit 10 uh, in terms of uh, doctrine for armed forces or for the battle side of it anyway okay I guess our timer went off so this would be a good place to uh, cut the episode right here. Uh, thank you guys for joining me. I hope you'll join me in the next episode. You know, I should have marched him out as Crane because I didn't expect him to be... Uh, that was a wrong call. I put him an arrow. To anyway, it demonstrates the kind of deadliness of our level 10 uh, battle prowess uh, compared because of our doctrine. Uh, anyway, that shows it. Uh, the crane would have shown it too. Uh, and I should have marched him out as the crane. Because with the crane, he would be able to uh, take on all of these properties here. At an accelerated rate. Double the... Uh, rather than... Uh, right now, it's pretty narrow. It would have been double the uh, the influence. Right now, look at the narrow thing. So, if, anyway, that was the wrong thing. But that's okay. Um... So the coverage of his clearing of this, all of these will rep they represent our control of the area. And so the earlier we get control of the area, then the earlier we will get... Uh, oh, we're at 9.8 now. Because uh, with each turn, uh, I think we are, we are eating into this part. We just ate through some of these. We will eat through some more of these. And then hopefully we will hit 10, 10%. And then we should get our next rank up. If not, I, I'm ready to send uh, one melee unit and a couple of uh, catapults just to take Hulao Gate. And then hopefully that will give us 10. Anyway, uh, I guess this would be a good place to cut the I've said that before. Okay. Uh, I will see you in the next episode. Bye.